So I've lost eight kgs and eight centimeters off my waist in less than eight weeks. Ooh, let's go. Yeah. Go back to the start of the video. You'll see that Matthew is using a standing desk. And right now I'm walking or talking to you to illustrate a point that whenever I'm talking on the phone, I'm always walking and I encourage my clients to do the same. Now, obviously, this is a bit different because this is a video call. Right? So I'm actually going to stand because otherwise it's going to be super annoying. But whenever I'm talking on the phone and it's not video, I'm always walking in circles, walking back and forth. I'm constantly moving because I always say, oh, my desk is super messy. Let's look at the beautiful view. I always say, don't sit if you can stand. Don't stand if you can walk. Don't walk if you can jog. Jogging might not be realistic in most circumstances, but walking is realistic in most circumstances. And the reason why I believe implementing all the simple hacks, using a standing desk, walking or talking on the phone, having a water bottle within arm's reach, improving the quality of your sleep, small things that don't take any time, take minimal effort, but move the needle in your favor are super crucial, especially if you're a person like Matthew who has a ton of things going on, has kids, has jobs, doesn't have time to go to the gym, doesn't have time to meal prep, doesn't have the option to eat the same food every single day because he eats out at restaurants often. If you're that type of person, then having structure is more important than anyone. So if you're a person who has a bunch of things going on and you still want to sustainably lose weight without going to the gym while still eating the food you love, then go ahead and click the link in the description and book a 15-minute call with me to see if and how I can help you. Again, not a sales call. I just want to see if I can help. And if you don't want to do that, all good. Check out the next video, which will be another testimonial, and I'll try to give you a few more hacks of how to sustainably lose weight without going to the gym.